Hi guys, it's Kay Chak, and today we're going to finish our series looking at professions in 9.2 that can gather new rare resources. Today it is a turn of fishing. I feel first it's important to say that even though we did spend around 5 hours testing this on the PTR, we have less confidence about what we found on fishing than we did on the other three gathering professions. I'm sure if you are viewing this video well after 9.2 release, then there could well be some more reliable data out there. So, fishing then. It's so easy, relaxing, probably one of the least stressful farms you can do while you're semi-AFK. Nothing can possibly go wrong. As you can see, we have loads of places we can fish here in Zerif Mortis. Yes, I know this bit looks blue, but don't go trying fishing down here because it doesn't end well. You can walk on all the water in Zerif Mortis, so if you're an idiot like me who can never seem to get that right, you can't really go wrong here. We have two potential different farms that we can run with fishing in 9.2. Firstly, let's start with farming the new rare fish. Now, you can get pulls of these, but to me, the pulls seemed inconsistent to spawn and obviously that means you would have to actually move as well. Throwing on a bait and going ham seemed to work fine, although you did get quite a bit of lost soul, it did seem to get results. You can get the baits while fishing, but they can also buy an unlimited supply from this guy who is located here. I did not seem to notice a massive difference between where I fished in Zerif Mortis whilst I was static fishing with a bait. Okay, so what is this fish used for? Because that is what is going to determine its value. Its only use in the game is as a contributor to the new feast, the stone soup. This is basically an empty feast that someone with cooking can make, throw on the floor, and everyone in the raid can contribute until it turns into a full feast that then everyone can eat four stats as usual. The most important thing about this feast is that it only gives you the same amount of stats as the feasts that are already in the game. So the entire value of this fish is based on how much people are going to value having feasts that people contribute to rather than having one person that has paid for everything. In super organized groups they won't want to lose 10 seconds per wipe it takes messing about contributing to the feast. There's probably a happy place somewhere in the middle that it gets good use but I'm not convinced this is going to completely take off even though I do like the idea. This is all without even taking into account that people probably have stockpile feasts or materials from mission tables to make the other feasts. Overall I'm not very convinced about the value of this fish so let's have a look at the second farm, Prog Essence Farm. Prog essences will be massively in demand in 9.2. They are basically the new core fight crystals, but are also used to craft the highest level crafters mark gear. During our testing, time was probably split approximately 50-50 between doing static farms and doing pool farms. We didn't get a single prog essence from static fishing farming and we managed to get two from pools. Even though our testing numbers were quite low, I can only conclude that prog essence farms are much better when you do pools. On the map, these two areas did not seem to spawn any pools at all during testing. So basically, you are sitting around the middle-ish of the map here. Without flying, I simply did not have enough pools or had excessive travel time. Additionally, there are mobs quite close to some pools that leave dots on you, so you can't go back to fishing until that has expired annoyingly. Even with flying, it still didn't feel a great farm. I got just less than one prog essence an hour, but all the other stuff in my bags didn't feel like it was worth a lot. My conclusion based on PTR testing is that I don't think fishing is going to be great in 9.2. I would love to be proven wrong as my data is limited, but you can farm prog essences elsewhere and also be getting other valuable stuff at the same time. Thanks for taking the time to watch guys. 
If you can hit like, subscribe, all that good stuff really helps me out. And I've got some other videos for you popping up on the screen right now.